I'm going to send Valkyrian the Magnet Warrior and Berserkion the Electro Magnet Warrior from my hand to summon. And okay. I didn't think I was going to get to use this. Imperium Magnum the Superconducting Battle Bot. Okay. I don't know. All right. We gotta, <laughs> we gotta read him. So before we start this video, I actually have a really big announcement. We just dropped our first two playmats. One is based on the Melfi archetype. It looks fantastic. It's very cute, very colorful. And the other is based on the new Dogmatica archetype, sort of re-envision in a sort of fantasy medieval way. You can get them both on inkgaming.com. They're available with zones, without zones. You can have worldwide shipping. I really hope you guys like these playmats and consider picking them up. All right, back to the video. In today's new entanglement, we are going to be dueling with Yugi and Kaiba structure decks. I've got Kaiba because I'm the snobby rich rival. And I've got Yugi because I've got a lot of hair. So we're gonna be using three of each of these structure decks because you guys have asked us to start using three of these. So this costs a little bit more money. So please thumbs up the video. Hey, please like these. Yeah. So we're gonna see whether ABCs can beat Magnet, Magnet Warriors. Ho, ho, ho. I guess uh, without further ado, Let's get to the deck building. Imperion Magnum, the super conductive battle bot. You know what? I used to play this deck and I've never read this name before. Oh, there's the other one. Berserkion, the Electromagnet Warrior. Magna Warrior. Then we got Alpha, Beta, and Gamma. These are the new ones. We got Old School with the Originals. This is the guy I want to summon on him right here. <laughs> My spirit animals. Yeah. Actually, it's all three of them. Huh? I got a Creeper though. My life is going to be saved. Y'all going to see. Like this is like I I understand like why they these cards in here, but this is just a weird mix of cards. Like this is literally the first season of Yu-Gi-Oh, all over again. I know it's this actually this deck was apparently like pretty prevalent in the meta just because of Dragon Buster and these guys. It's probably the stronger structure deck on paper, although because it's a structure deck, I'm not so sure. Hmm. So they kind of divided Kaiba's new machine thing with the blue eyes just sort of old cards so that's going to be a little bit weird to okay i guess the mvp of the uh the battle pack union hanger really was a common huh for some reason i guess i always thought it was like a super rare and then our other fusions which i don't think i really will be making too often but it's cool that they're in here so we'll see how this goes um i'll be playing yugi's magna warrior deck uh, the goal of this pretty much is to let my monsters die and hopefully they'll rise from the ashes and become bigger monsters. Um, I know that my opponent's playing the uh, ABC uh, deck and that deck is actually pretty good. Um, I feel like it's, it's not an even match, but at the same time I am the king of games. Um, my monsters don't do much, but they get bigger. And we're just going to try to get big and beefy. So I'm playing the ABC deck. My goal is basically to see Union Hanger, which will help me see my new Union Monsters, which is A, Assault Core, B, something, and C, Crush Wyvern. And by banishing all of them, I'm able to summon my ABC Dragon Buster, which actually lets me banish cards in the field, and he can swap himself out to summon them back. So basically, I'll be looping a lot of Union Monsters in this duel. I'll take first. Basically. Okay, uh, I'll set a card face down, two cards face down, and pass my turn. I'll draw for turn. Normal summon a beta, the Electro Magnet Warrior. On summon, it lets me search out a level four Lord Magnet Warrior monster from my deck to my hand, except for himself. I will use my Fiendish Chain. Target your beta to negate its effect. I'm gonna go ahead and set one card face down in my turn. I'll draw. I will set a monster face down and set a card face down and pass. I will draw for turn. Normal summon alpha. Add a level eight Magnet Warrior from my uh, deck to my hand. Berserkian, why do I forget his name? I'm gonna attempt to move towards battle. So attack for 17 into your 2000 defense. You attack my heavy mech support armor. Oh, no. What does it do? Nothing. I'm gonna in phase, <laughs> in turn. Draw for turn. Normal summon my wide dragon head. I'll set a card face down and I'll pass. I'm gonna draw for turn. I'm gonna normal summon another uh, alpha to get another search for a level 8 monster. Attempt to move towards battle. One alpha is going to attempt to attack you. I will. I will activate rollout. So I target a union monster in my graveyard and I can equip it to an appropriate target. So I'm going to target this and have it equipped to wide dragon head. So that battle goes through. So I'll take 200 damage, but my heavy mech support armor will be destroyed instead. Okay, and then I'm going to attempt to swing with the other alpha. That'll be fine. So another 200? So I'll take another 200. In turn. Draw for turn. Set. 
Set, go. I'm going to draw for turn. Uh, Tempt move towards battle phase. Attempt to swing with this alpha. You attacked my C crush oh, wyvern there is. There's the with problem. 2,000 defense. 2,000, yeah, I take 300. Man phase 2, obviously. Set a card, switch defense, in turn. Nothing. Draw. I'm going to pass. Draw for turn. Set, go. Draw. Set, go. Draw. Set, go. Draw. I'll switch my C crush wyvern to attack position. We're going to enter the battle phase. Use my C crush wyvern and attack alpha the magnet, electro magnet warrior. In response, I'm going to activate mirror force. My enemy controller. I'll be using the tribute effect. So I'm going to tribute my C crush wyvern targeting alpha. Alpha gets destroyed. Main phase two. Set and pass. Draw. I'm going to activate polymerization. I'm going to send Valkyrie the magnet warrior and berserk on the electromagnet warrior from my hand to summon and okay. I didn't think I was gonna get to use this Imperium Magnum the superconducting battle bot attempt to move towards battle I'm gonna attempt to swing with the big guy you attacked my B Buster Drake when it's destroyed I can use its effect to add a union monster from my deck to my hand so I'm gonna activate it negate it okay well, <laughs> I'll swing for 1700 I'll activate my call of the haunted okay and I'm gonna target B Buster Drake so attempt to swing 17 into your 15. All right, I'll activate my B Buster Drake's effect. No response. So I can add A Assault Core. In turn. Draw. Normal summon my A Assault Core. Summon my ABC Dragon Buster by banishing these. Uh, ABC Dragon no Buster way. to the field. I banish these three to summon it, and it has an effect that lets me discard a card during either player's turn. Target a card on the field and banish it, and I can also tribute it in your turn to summon my banished guys back. I will activate my Union Scramble. I can target up to three of my Light Machine type normal monsters and or Light Machine type Union monsters, special summon them. And then it has a graveyard effect, except the turn it was sent, where I can banish it and target a banished Light Machine and return it to the hand. Union Scramble, I'll summon back. Back, Crush Wyvern, Buster Drake, Assault Core. Use these again. Banish the three to summon another ABC Dragon Buster. Now I'll activate the effect of this ABC Dragon Buster and discard my rollout to target your Valkyrian. Gate destroyed. And I'll activate this ABC Dragon Buster, mm -hmm. discard my Union Scramble, and target Valkyrian and banish it. Valkyrian's effect when he leaves the field activates. Do you have those things in your hand? Wow! <laughs> I do. Pass to you. Draw for turn. Uh, stand my faith, anything? I will activate my Union Scramble. So since it wasn't sent this turn, I can banish it and target one of these guys and add them back to my hand. I'll get my B Buster Drake. Not but cool. I activate and target. Um, I'm going to chain ABC Dragon Buster and discard my B Buster Drake. Targeting. And target Berserkion. I'm going to attempt to move towards battle. Yeah. I'm going to attempt 17. Uh, then I'm going to attempt 35. Yes. And then main phase 2, end phase, in turn. All right, I'll draw for turn. Yeah, I'll use Union Scramble and target my A Assault Core. Add it to my hand. I'll normal summon A Assault Core. Enter the battle phase. A Assault Core will attack Alpha with 1900. You've activated my trap card, Magic Cylinder. Okay, and I will set. One card face down, pass turn to you. Draw for turn. I will Swords Conceal and Light your Monster. So for two standby phases, it cannot be put face up or change back. Then I'm going to Normal Summon Beta, the Electromagnetic Warrior. Much allows good. me to search a Beta <coughs> Warrior. I'm going to get a Gamma. Um, and then I'm going to Banish, Banish, and Banish to Special Summon this one. Another Berserkion, what? Attempt to move towards the battle phase. I'm going to swing with the beta. You attacked my A Assault Core. It has an effect. I can get a Union Monster from my grave to my hand. I'll get a B Buster Drake. Attempt to swing with the Le the Valkyrian original. The I don't have anything. So what? That's that. <laughs> okay. That's okay. That was just a warm up, by the way. Okay, just thought I'd you. put that out there. I, you know, I thought I'd go easy on you. I appreciate Yugi. that because I really needed it. Uh, when you when I crush you this time, there are. Uh, what, is they, what do they say in the anime? You won't stand a ghost of a chance. Well, luckily, uh, my Pharaoh is a ghost, and he gives me a chance. Set one, two, and three, and I'll pass. I will draw for turn. I'm going to attempt to summon, normal summon Alpha, the Electromagnetic Warrior. It allows me to get a level eight Magnet Warrior to the hand. I will add a Berserkion. I know how much you love that card. Um, then I'm going to attempt to move towards the battle phase. I'm going to swing at you for 1700. Main phase two, I'm going to activate Swords Revealing Light. In phase, in turn. Draw, I'll set and pass. Because I won't be doing any attacking anyway. Draw for turn, stand by phase, mm -hmm. main phase. Moving towards battle phase, I will attempt to attack. You attacked my heavy mech support platform. Okay, uh, main phase two, I'm gonna set one card in the back row. In phase, in turn. Draw, 
I'll normal summon my heavy mech support armor. When it's normal summoned, I can target a union monster in my grave and special summon it. And I'll target another copy of itself. Activate heavy mech support armor's effect to equip to heavy mech support armor. Oh, so it will be destroyed. So if he'd be destroyed, this will be destroyed. And I'm just trying to live here so rude, for a little bit. What else you got? Go ahead. I'm going to draw for turn. I'm going to summon Beta, the Electromagnet Warrior. Yes. On summon, it searches out one of the uh, other Magnet Warriors besides itself. I'm going to add another Alpha to the hand. Attempt to move towards Battle Phase. Beta will attempt to attack the, uh, thank you, my boo -boo -boo. I'll use my Negate Attack, which negates your attack, and ends the Battle Phase. All right, um, Main Phase 2. No, no, in Phase, in turn. <laughs> Draw. I'll set one in pass. I'm going to draw for turn. I'm going to normal summon another alpha and attempt to activate his effect to search. I'm going to get another berserk in. Attempt to move towards battle. Beta will attempt to swing. Okay, so my heavy mech support armor will be destroyed instead. Alpha will attempt to swing. And then I'll attempt 17. I have to take that. And then I'll attempt 4,000. Main phase 2. Activate towards reveal light. In phase. In turn. Draw. I can't do anything, so I'll just scoop there. Good games. <laughs> Good game, bro. Good games. Um, that did not turn out the way we expected. And I say we because... Yeah. We both well, I, I have a very game. unexpected result. <laughs> but I will say I'm glad I got the fusion monster out. I got to use my extra deck. I got a fusion monster out, so I can, you know. Sure, you got, you got, I summoned the fusion monster. You got the fusion monster. <laughs> but how's it feel to lose with the favorite deck? Um, about as bad as usual, <laughs> I suppose. But it's fun. This is a cool deck. I was going to say my union hanger, but unfortunately I couldn't. I'm just glad I put polarization in my deck. Because originally I was just going to play like level 3, level 4, beat and hope for the best. I'm kind of glad I didn't get defusioned though. That would have sucked too. <laughs> on camera, like you thought you did something. See, I think they put that in there because they knew about things like this. Like, if this deck faces that deck, that deck just defused me. Well, no, I think it's because they mean for us to actually summon the Magna Warriors. Yeah, like, manually. And, right, manually and then do know. it. Nobody gets to work that hard in Yu-Gi-Oh these days, so. But it, it, was, it was a good counter to whatever you're trying to do with the, with the ABC Buster, so. Anyways, if you guys liked this duel, be sure to give it a thumbs up and let us know what structure decks we should play with next. Um, we have a few more coming in the mail, hopefully, you know, depending. Sometimes the mail's not always reliable. But yeah, um, that was it. Let us know what you thought about it in the comments, and we'll see you in the next one. Faster. I'm the boss! <laughs>